you got to watch out for the charismatics. And you got to watch out for the charismatic movement. Two of the greatest writers and two of the greatest people in the Bible is Paul. Paul was <coughs> and he got saved. His name was Saul. He was persecuting Christians, chasing them around. He was a Pharisee of the Pharisees. He was a Jew. Hunted him down until he came to the road of Damascus. He became blind. The Lord spoke to him. And the Lord said, you know, who art thou? He saw one know. He said, it's hard to kick against the pricks. This is Jesus. He got saved. got blind. got healed. Blindness went away. Later in life, though, he develops uh, cataracts. You'll have to read the chapter. You can Google it. Where does it suggest where Paul went has cataracts in his eyes? And it'll tell you the scriptures. That's the easiest way to do it. Not modern times in the year 2000. He had cataracts. Timothy had stomach problems. And so what's the old man say? Paul, he's the elder. He says, stop drinking water, Timothy. He said, young pastor, you got ulcers. These church members are driving you crazy. He says, so what I recommend is don't drink no more water. Drink, just drink a little, drink wine. The wine was grape juice. He said, get off the water, just drink grape juice. Why? It's, it's to reduce the ulcers. And so... If Paul couldn't get healed in the New Testament, and Timothy couldn't get healed in the New Testament, and then Paul talks about other people dying and says, you know, I pray and I ask the Lord to, you know, to raise this brother up because I've had so much sorrow in my life. And if he couldn't, you know, bring back to dead the, the loved ones that he had in his family and uh, his ministry, uh, that suggests to me that the gifts of healing were gone. Just like the, the, the uh, gifts of tongues. Do you say, do you believe in tongues? Yeah, because it talks about speaking in unknown tongues. But I believe, again, it was a gift that is gone. And, and the Bible talks about the gift.